Hi there, Grover. What all this stuff here? These are delicious and nutritious fruits and vegetables. Very fresh. I picked them this morning. Me heard about these fruits and vegetables. Yeah, they supposed to be very good for you. So me here. But how me choose what to eat? It is simple. All you have to do is eat your colors. Me colors. Sounds tricky. Oh, it is not tricky at all. It is fun. We will show you. You need to put one food in each bin that is the same color. So put a red food in the red bin and a purple food in the purple bin. Go ahead, click on a food. Tomato. Tomato. Ah, this is a wonderful fruit. It no, it is a vegetable. Um, fruit, vegetable. Ah, it looks like a vegetable, but it is really a fruit. You can eat a tomato sliced up, or some tangy tomato sauce on your spaghetti, or a nice bowl of tomato soup. Soup, er. Pumpkin. Pumpkin. You can carve a pumpkin for Halloween, but you can also eat a pumpkin. Yes, you can. You can eat pumpkin soup or mashed pumpkin, or for dessert there is pumpkin pie. Banana. Banana. Bananas are a tasty treat, and they come in their own wrapper. But when you are done eating one, make sure you do not leave the peel lying around, or somebody might slip on it. Honeydew. Honeydew. What a wonderful melon! It helps you grow. It is good for your blood and your digestion, and not only that, but it is very sweet and delicious. Plums. Plums. A plum is a sweet and juicy fruit. And remember this: eating plums helps you remember things. Like eating plums helps you remember things. We did it! See, Cookie Monster. There is a red food, an orange food, a white food, a green food, and a purple food. See if you can eat five different colors every day. The stuff good for monster. Then me know what to do. Eat healthy. Um nom nom nom. Oh yeah. Um nom 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 nom. Ah, me feel healthier already. Oh, excuse me. Oh. What is this? Aha! Uh -huh, a delectable baked good. This one on the house. You sure about this? Me told you me trying to eat healthy stuff. You can be healthy and still have a cookie sometimes. Okay. Me think sometimes is right now. Cookie. Um nom nom. Oh yeah yeah. Ah nom nom yeah. Nom 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 nom. Now do you understand how to eat your colors? Uh, me not sure. No, uh, show me again. Please help, Cookie Monster. Watermelon. Watermelon. If you are thirsty, this is the fruit for you. Watermelons are very, very juicy. I will see if I can find a napkin to go with your watermelon. Mango. No, I am sorry, but that food does not belong in that bin. Try again. Mango. Every mango has one giant seed inside, but all around that giant seed is one delicious fruit. Potato. Potato. There are so many ways to eat potatoes. You can eat baked potatoes, mashed potatoes, boiled potatoes, broiled potatoes, potato souffle, baked potato chips. I'm getting hungry just thinking about potatoes. Green beans. No, I am sorry, but that food does not belong in that bin. Try again. Green beans. When you cook them, they are yummy and soft. But when you eat them raw, they are crunchy. That is why I say green beans make a snappy snack. Ha ha ha. Grapes. Purple grapes. Grapes are great any time of day. Grapes for breakfast. Grapes for snack. Just make sure a grown up slices each grape into cute little pieces first. Wow! Look, footprints. Match the footprints to find out who made them. Ooh, a 
beautiful deer. Oh dear! <laughs> wow! More footprints! Oh, a rabbit! Hop along, rabbit! <laughs> wow! More footprints! A slithery snake in the sand! See you, slithery snake!
Step right up. Ride the rotten bumper cars. <laughs> oh, it looks like you're next. Wait a minute. You don't have a ticket. You gotta have a ticket to ride this ride. I'll give you a ticket if you can give me two pieces of trash that begin with the letter X. Yes. Yes. Hmm. Fine. Here's your ticket. You can go on the ride, but don't have any fun. Use your mouse to drive the blue bumper car. You can go ahead and bump into the other cars. <laughs> It's fun. <laughs> Grouches, get ready, go! You want to ride again? Haven't you had enough bouncing around with grouches and trashy cars? Well, fine. To get a ticket, bring me three pieces of trash that start with the letter Y. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Great. Waffle. Hmm. That doesn't sound right. Try again. We need to find things that start with the letter Y. Okay. Hmm. Fine. Here's your ticket. You can go on the ride, but don't have any fun. Use your mouse to drive the blue bumper car. You can go ahead and bump into the other cars. <laughs> It's fun. <laughs> Grouches, get ready, go! Hey, why don't you play with us? Whoa, we, <laughs> wahoo! Brrr, we better find Ernie quick. He might get pretty cold wherever he's hiding. Well, Ernie is already hiding, but before he hid, he gave me a clue. He said that he would be behind something you wear. Wow, you did it! You found Ernie! Hooray! <laughs> Here we go! Whoa! Wow! Wow, this is the hardest part of the game for me. Hey, it's a jungle out here. Hmm, maybe that's because it is a jungle out here. We're in a jungle. Gee, have you seen Ernie? He's gone again. I think he said he was hiding behind... Something that is alive. Yes, that's alive, but no Ernie. Oh, wait. I just remembered more of Ernie's clue. He said that he would be hiding behind... Something that is alive and has four legs. There he is. You found Ernie. <laughs> Good work. Whoa, wee, <laughs> wahoo. Where are we? Let me see. There's an oink oink here and a moo moo there. Hey, we're on a farm. Ernie, Ernie, have you seen Ernie? Let's see if I can remember the clue. I think he's hiding behind something that is alive. That's alive, all right. 
But where is Ernie? There must be more to his clue. Oh, oh, he said that he'd be behind something that is alive and has spots. Let's see. That is alive and it has very nice spots, but Ernie isn't there either. Hey, there's one more part of the clue. Look for Ernie behind something that is alive, has spots, and makes this sound. <coughs> is it Bert? No, it's Ernie. <laughs> you did it. Congratulations. Here we go again. Yay! What's all that noise? Oh, it's coming from those musical instruments. This must be the world of music. <laughs> Ernie said he was going to hide behind something that makes music. You're right, that makes music. So where is Ernie? Oh yeah, there's more to his clue. He said to look behind. Something that makes music is brown and has strings. There he is! It's Ernie! We found him! Here we go! Whoa! Wow! Wow, this is the hardest part of the game for me. What kind of place is this? That Ernie picked some very strange places to hide. Well, Ernie is already hiding. But before he hid, he gave me a clue. He said that he would be behind something that floats. Yes, that does float, but Ernie's not there. Wait, I just remembered more of the clue. Ernie told me that he's hiding behind something that floats and is yellow. That does float, and it is yellow. But Ernie's not there either. Gee, Ernie's clues sure are hard to remember. But I think I've got it. Ernie is hiding behind something that floats, is yellow, and squeaks. Ernie, we found you! Yay! Elmo needs your help counting these eggs. When we've counted them all, we can see. One. Two, three, four. Great job! Elmo wants to be a chicken. Elmo wants to be a duck, 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 duck. Come on, everybody! Clap your arms like a chicken. Clap your arms like a chicken. Clap, 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 clap. Very good. Make a sound like a chicken. Make a sound like a chicken. Clap, 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 clap. Elmo wants to be a chicken. Elmo wants to be a duck. <laughs> there are more eggs for us to count. One, two, three, four, five, six. You are a great help. Elmo's chicken, he's not scared. Elmo's always well prepared. And he meets all kinds of people every day. Elmo's chicken, hear him clap. up a dance with you. You can help me make up a dance right away or help me pick out an outfit to dance in first. When you decide, click on one of the hearts. What should I wear? <laughs>
Choose the outfit you'd like me to wear while I dance. Click on one of the stars. Now let's dance. <laughs> let's make up a dance together. Click on one of the dance styles. Keep clicking on dance styles until the counter is full. Stylish! Yay! You're making up a great dance. Funky! I love that dance. You used all the squares. Hey, you made the everything dance. Hooray! Now, click on the green button to watch me dance your dance. Yay! Now I will dance. On vacation! I am traveling all around the world! I am meeting new people and learning new games, and I am sending postcards from every place I visit! We can make a postcard from any of these countries! Click one of the little pictures to begin. Greece! There are many yummy foods to eat in Greece, like olives and feta cheese, oh, and octopus! Yasu! That is how you say hello in Greece. That torch is passed from person to person from Greece all the way to where the Olympics are going to be played. That is a bouzouki. It is a Greek instrument that has eight strings. That is a very old Greek temple. Mmm! Those are stuffed grape leaves. Believe it or not, they are really leaves. And they are stuffed with delicious rice. There are lots of other postcards to make. Click on a different picture. Mexico. I had a very exciting time in Mexico. Hola. Let us have to say hello in Mexico. Soccer, or football, is very popular in Mexico. Shake those maracas. That is a Mayan pyramid. The Gila monster is a cute monster, just like your lovable world traveler Grover. There are lots of other postcards to make. Click on a different picture. Egypt. There is a lot of sand in Egypt, so bring your sandals if you go there. Aha! Uh -huh. Salam. That is how you say hello in Egypt. Backgammon is a very popular game in Egypt. A felucca is a boat that people use on the Nile River in Egypt. The pyramids were built a very, 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 very long time ago. Camels are a great way to get around the deserts of Egypt. Let us make another postcard together. Click on another little picture. We will make a postcard from Japan. The land of the rising sun. Konnichiwa! That is how to say hello in Japan. That is a sumo wrestler. I would hate to get in the ring with him. Sushi is raw fish. <laughs> I think it is delicious. Aha! Uh -huh. Mount Fuji is the tallest mountain in Japan. Koi are beautiful fish that first came from Japan. There are lots of other postcards to make. Click on a different picture. We will make a postcard from the land down under, Australia. Good day, mate. That is how to say hello in Australia. 
throw a boomerang and it will come back at you. That is the Sydney Opera House. That is a didgeridoo. Didgeridoo-doo-doo. Aha. Uh -huh. Kangaroos live only in Australia. And baby kangaroos live only in the patches of mommy kangaroos in Australia. Let's make clouds. Click on the cloud pieces at the side of the screen and put them in the sky to make whatever you want. Making a silly sound. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
acting silly. <laughs> Naughty animals switch sounds. <laughs> Ooh, that's better. <laughs> that sounds like the Elmo. <laughs> Naughty animals switch sounds. <laughs> right. That sounds like the Elmo. We can only eat things that start with the letter T. Tuba. Um, yeah, um, um, oh, um, oh, um. <sighs> Tie. Um, yeah, um, um, oh, um, oh, um. <sighs> Pig. We want to, but we don't can eat that cookie. Top. Um, yeah, um, um, oh, um, oh, um. <sighs> you good at cookie game. We play again.
Oh, I feel better soon, Elmo. Hey, I'm visiting the animals in the animal shelter. This is a safe place for them to live until somebody comes to adopt them and take them home. Oh, it's bedtime for the animals now. They have to go in their pen so they can go to sleep. Oh boy, I could really use your help. We need to put the doggies away in the right pens. Okay, let's put all the red dogs in this pen and all the blue dogs in that pen. Okay, here's what you need to do. Click on a dog and put it in one of the pens. Right! Nice! Okay! Uh-huh! You did it! You put everybody in the right pens! Go to sleep. Oh no! Everybody's out of the pens again! Let's see. Maybe we can think of a different way to put the doggies away. Oh, I got an idea. Let's try putting the big dogs in this pen and the small dogs in that pen. All right! <laughs> right! All right. <laughs> Good. You did it. You put everybody in the right pens. Go to sleep, doggies. <laughs> hey, what happened? The dogs are out of their pens again. We'd better think how else we can put them away. I got it. I got it. Try putting the dogs with long ears in this pen and the dogs with short ears in that pen. Uh-huh. I don't think that's the right pen for that doggy. Okay. Uh-huh. Good. Yay! All the animals are in the pens. Sweet dreams. Oh, hello there. I, Grover, have been learning new dances from children all over the world. Yes. And I have brought with me some dancing costumes from different countries. Choose the outfit you'd like me to wear while I dance. Chinese acrobat costume. Here we go. Let's make a dance together. Click on one of the dance moves. Keep clicking on dance moves until the counter is full. You sure know a lot about making up dances. Hooray! This looks very funky. I cannot wait to dance your dance. Terrific! You used all the tiles. That will keep this monster on his toes. I'm ready to dance your dance now. Click on the green button, please. Stand back. I, Grover, monster of the dance.
will now dance Chinese acrobatics. I love this dance! Click there to choose another kind of dance. Pick one of these dancing costumes and then we can make up a dance together! Stilts from Trinidad! Now we shall dance! Click on one of the dance moves. Keep clicking on dance moves until the counter is full. Hooray! Terrific! You used all the tiles! That will keep this monster on his toes. I'm ready to dance your dance now! Click on the green button, please! Now I shall dance your dance! The Stilt Dance from Trinidad! I am a superhero, and I am on duty right now. Please help me! <gasps> Super Grover must save the day! Super Grover is on his way! Oh, I made a little rhyme! Did you not hear it? Day and way end in the same sound! That is a rhyme! I really could use some help! Oh, yes, yes, of course! Here I come! Wubba, wubba, wubba! <laughs> Don't worry, little girl. Super Grover is here to rescue you. 
But I don't need to be rescued. I lost my cat. Oh, well, I knew that. <laughs> Wait right here, and I will fly up to the top of this tree and find your cat. But, but I don't think it's up there. That, holy foliage! There are quite a few things up in this treetop. How did all this stuff get here anyway? Oh, never mind. I will just find the little girl's cat. Hmm. I did not see it. What to do? I know. I will ponder with my super brain. Hmm. Ponder, ponder. Aha! Since I cannot find the cat, we will find something that rhymes with cat. Click on the thing that sounds like cat. Hat. You chose the hat. Let us see. Does that rhyme? Hat. Hat. Yes. Both of those things end in at. I will bring this down to the little girl. Oh, she will be so happy. <laughs> oh! Oh, oh, oh. Uh, do not worry, little girl. I, Super Grover, bravely flew to the top of this very tall tree. And I've saved your hat. But that's not what I lost. I lost my cat. Yes, I know. And this rhymes with it. Listen, hat, hat. Oh, here it is. Well, I am glad I could be of super service. Stand back. I am about to fly. At least you are going to try. All right, all right. That is quite enough rhyming for now. Up, up, and away! <laughs> oh! 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 Have no fear, because ow, Super Grover is here. Oh, I'm not afraid. I am sad though, because I've lost my bear. I think it may be up on the roof. You do not say. Very well. I soup. Super Grover will fly up to the roof. Stand back. That car. Wow. There sure are a lot of things up here on this roof. Now, what are we looking for? Oh yes, the little boy lost his hair. Hmm. I do not see one of those, but I think there is something up here that ends in the same sound. Click on the thing that sounds like hair. Car. You chose the car. Let us see. Does that rhyme? Hair. Car. Hmm. Those words do not sound the same to me. Listen carefully. Find something that rhymes with hair. Chair. You chose the chair. Let us see. Does that rhyme? Hair. Chair. Yes. Both of those things end in air. I will bring this down to the little boy post haste. He will be so happy. Wow! Oh, oh, oh. uh, little boy, everything is fine. Worry your little head no more. I have here your long lost chair. That's not what I lost. I lost my bear. I know that, little boy. I have super hearing after all. But this rhymes with the thing you lost. Listen, chair. Bear. Wow, that is true. But I really want my bear. Oh, there it is. Do not thank me. Helping people is what I do. Now I must go help someone new. Oh, I made another little rhyme. Yeah, it was very nice. Thank you. Now stand back. Da -da -da -da! Yeah, you're here. Elmo was waiting for you. Guess what Elmo's thinking about today? Da 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 da! Weather. Whoa! Yeah, Elmo wants to go outside and play. Elmo will get dressed and put on his. Oh, wait a minute! Elmo can't get dressed until he knows what the weather is like today. Why don't you tell Elmo what kind of weather it is? Choose the kind of weather you like to have. Sunny, a hot and sunny summer day.
look on the clothes you want Elmo to wear for this weather. Bathing suit, a swimsuit, and sunglasses. Elmo loves this outfit. Thank you. Yay! Elmo's dressed for a sunny day at the beach. Let's go swimming. Elmo loves thinking about the weather. Let's change it and see what happens. Rainy. A warm and rainy spring day. Well, this is a right outfit for getting wet, but not in the rain. Elmo thinks some different clothes might be better for this weather. Don't you think? It's raining. Click on the clothes you wear when it's a rainy day. Raincoat. An umbrella, a raincoat, and rubber boots. Thank you for helping Elmo get dressed. Oh, hey, it's raining. Good thing Elmo has his umbrella. <coughs> nice and dry. <laughs> you know what they say. If you don't like the weather, change it. <laughs> Go ahead. Choose a different kind of day. Snowy. A snowy cold winter day. <laughs> Elmo will see if his umbrella will make him warmer. <laughs> might be better for this weather, don't you think? It's cold and snowy. Click on the clothes you wear to play in the snow. Scarf and mittens. A coat, woolly hat, scarf, mittens, and boots. Thank you for helping Elmo get dressed. Yay! Elmo loves playing in the snow, especially when he's wearing the right clothes. <coughs> Watch out! <laughs> Elmo loves thinking about the weather. Let's change it and see what happens. Jacket. A jacket, long pants, and sneakers. Wow, it's a little colder out here than Elmo thought. Do you think you could find Elmo a scarf or some mittens? Elmo thinks some different clothes might be better for this weather. Don't you think? It's cold and snowy. Click on the clothes you wear to play in the snow. A chilly and windy fall day. Yay! The leaves are turning pretty colors, the air is chilly, and Elmo's wearing the perfect outfit. Thank you. Elmo loves getting dressed. Pick something else for Elmo to wear. A swimsuit and sunglasses. Elmo hopes his beach ball doesn't blow away. Could you catch that for Elmo, please? Oh, thank you. Yes, throw it back. Oh. <laughs> you can change the weather outside or the clothes that Elmo is wearing. Go ahead. Click on it. An umbrella, a raincoat, and rubber boots. It's not raining, but Elmo will try to put up his umbrella anyway. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. You can change the weather outside or the clothes that Elmo is wearing. Go ahead, click on it. A hot and sunny summer day. Mmm, it's very sunny. Hey, Elmo has an idea for his umbrella. <laughs> there. <laughs> Elmo thinks some different clothes might be better for this weather. Don't you think? A jacket, long pants, and sneakers. Hmm, Elmo's getting awfully warm with this jacket and long pants on. Elmo thinks some different clothes might be better for this weather. Don't you think? A warm and rainy spring day. Elmo's warm, but he's getting very wet. Elmo thinks some different clothes might be better for this weather. Don't you think? A coat, woolly hat, scarf, mittens, and boots. Boy, Elmo's wearing a lot of clothes that are all getting very saggy. Yuck! <laughs> Elmo thinks some different clothes might be better for this weather. Don't you think? A hot and sunny summer day. Hmm, Elmo's feeling a little warm. Whoa, now he's feeling hot. Now he's feeling very, very hot. Elmo thinks some different clothes might be better for this weather. Don't you think? Boy, it's a chilly and windy fall day. Hmm, Elmo feels a little overdressed. <laughs> Boy, that's better. You can change the weather outside or the clothes that Elmo is wearing. Go ahead, click on it. 
a snow week, a swimsuit, and sunglasses. <laughs> Elmo is glad he has this fur because this winter weather is too cold for these clothes. Oh, 